Hello, my name is Rich White. I'm at Greenbush Education Service Center with the EduSim project. I've done several EduSim videos, and if you're not familiar with what EduSim is, it is a 3D virtual environment for your smart board that we're building using Croquet, and you can you can see that and get that at uh, edusim3d.com. Today, I'm going to be showing you and giving you a quick tour of Greenbush Island, which is our island in Second Life. We've had it for about six or eight, six to eight months, somewhere in that range now. It is a place for teachers to come, collaborate, and just meet and greet and discuss discuss things in a virtual environment. I did want to show you on the board kind of how this thing uh, reacts. We do have a teen grid as well. We're building that up. Um, it's really more for the high school age, teenage uh, age kids and students. This is really our teacher environment. EduSim we're seeing more of as, as something for our little, our smaller uh, students, our younger students. So I'm going to walk you through. I am using the wind lot, the wind light client, the new one. So here I am. We've got um, right here. We've got our uh, visitors pavilion. We've got our our auditorium, and we'll walk through those here in a minute. We've got our podcast, our podcast island, our observatory here, and then a um, vendor towers where our vendors have a our vendors have a presence there. This building here, well not here, I'm gonna get out of the way and turn around and look at it. This building here is our, our uh, Keeb Employment Board, our Kansas Teaching Job uh, building. So uh, prospective teachers can come here, uh, meet people if they're in, 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 uh, on the island here, or um, drop off their resumes and do several things. There are uh, links in, in here we'll go look at here in a minute too. We'll spin around and we'll just kind of start walking through the pavilion. So here's our pavilion. You've heard me mention EduSim. One of the things you will see um, here is our EduSim signage here. We've got, and this is actually a video. If you're on Greenbush Island, you can you can watch the, a quick video of. Uh, of the EduSim. We have this in several places and what this video is is a teacher building a lesson. So uh, and you'll simply just click your little media player down here down here in the lower bar and you can watch this uh, this video. So our EduSim video we've also got um, so got shot of our EduSim website. We've got the auditorium back here. We'll go walk in through that and just kind of look, see what we've got. Here's where we can do virtual presentations with voice enabled here in uh, Second Life on our island. Um, you can do, you can do uh, voice, direct voice chat with one another. Um, and then we've got our video still rolling here. Our, uh, our clickable sign here, so I click that. That will actually take us out to our website, to the EduSim website, if we wanted to go there. Spin around here, and you'll see our seating. This is our seating for when we do do our virtual uh, presentations and things like that. Let's uh, fly around here and look at a little bit more. So this is our podcast mountain here. In here we've got a bunch of um, of our media, our podcast media, our Take Two podcast and some of our other podcasts we've got in here. Um, and like I mentioned here is our vendor tower where we've got a vendor vendor presence. Um, this is our quick uh, little kind of a virtual observatory here. You can watch the live NASA television and you can see the earth and so that's what we've got there. Bird's eye view of Greenbush Island. We'll go down here and we'll look at uh, let's look at the Kansas Teaching Jobs building here real quick. get lined out here so I can land in a decent place. There we go. 
on the deck. Now let's just kind of walk in here. You'll see, as I mentioned, that uh, we do have some objects in here. Um, these things you can click, and that'll take you either to, to some of the uh, tutorial videos or our uh, or the actual Cans Employment Board um, website. We do have drop boxes here where you can drop off your resume if you're interested, um, and then other clickable objects so you can go back out to the website. I'll um, get up here and show you kind of with this wind light what it what it what it looks like here so you can get a better view of that. So this is it uh, just in the normal state that we have this island and I'm going to change the change it to sunrise and you'll see we've changed that but I'm going to spin around here so you can actually see what that does. It's pretty what they've done with uh, the new rendering is pretty pretty cool. Um, you can see how real that water's starting to look, and then the sky up here. If you watch close enough, you'll see the uh, the clouds here starting to kind of shape and move around. Um, and then you see the shading, what that's done with our with the rocks and our and our uh, green bush uh, green bush uh, podcast mountain there. What that really does. Turn around here, and I'll do it to uh, sunset. Now you see it setting back here, back behind, and with the water, and kind of what that does to the shading and to the uh, to the appearance of the island. Okay, so in a nutshell, that's Greenbush Island. Like I mentioned, this is our. Uh, Pavilion, Visitor's Pavilion, where we do do virtual coffees and meetups and things of that nature. Our auditorium, our um, the podcast mountain, our observatory, our vendor towers, and we do have a lot of EduSim signage there. If you're not familiar with it, go there and get a little information or edusim3d.com. Do a quick search. If you're in Second Life, find Greenbush Island and collaborate with other educators. But that's also how you, how you could use uh, Second Life on a surface. What I did is I just brought up the navigation uh, keys, a lot like with EduSim, they have the navigation keys so that um, you know you can move around here. Now creating objects is a, is a lot different with Ed, with EduSim. It's just a lot. It's just really easy dragging things in and, and with T-Painter, so it's really ideal for for actual classroom instruction. This is uh, I guess good in other ways, but that's what it looks like. Uh, so come on Greenwich Island and pay us a visit. And uh, my name is Growing Wise. My avatar name is Growing Wise. So look me up and we can chat anytime.